It's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon at Jones Beach, and you can see there's a fairly steady breeze coming off the ocean at this point. That's because the land next to me has a very low specific heat. So it heated up very quickly. It's an effective absorber, an effective radiator. It's given off a lot of infrared. And that warm area is creating low pressure. The ocean, however, is still really cold. Water has a very high specific heat. It's going to take a long time to heat up. So my high pressure is over the ocean right now. What direction does wind blow? High to low. So where we have low pressure, the air is rising off of my head because it's warmer. Then it's going to go across the top of the convection cell and sink where there's high pressure. And the bottom of that cell is the wind that we're feeling off the ocean, which is high pressure, and onto the land, which is low pressure. Now by about midnight, the land is going to radiate in all of its heat, and now it's going to be colder than the ocean, which hangs onto its heat. So now the ocean is going to be the low pressure area, and the land is the high pressure. So the wind is going to blow off the land and out to the ocean. And I would show you that, except it's really difficult to film in the middle of the night. 